from WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. Well, the good news tomorrow is going to be a brighter day, uh, literally and figuratively. More sunshine, less clouds, no rain chances. And we're going to be looking at a similar forecast for the next three days. So if you have any yard work that you've been kind of uh, slouching on, been delaying it, uh, lots of opportunities to do it. I will say there are reasons to get it done faster then wait till later and I'll break down those reasons in just a few minutes. High pressure going to be building in from the west as we head into the day tomorrow. That's going to equal clear skies and a northwesterly component to the wind. That northwesterly flow is what's going to make things feel so nice tomorrow. Dew points are going to be low and we're going to start off in the upper 50s at 7 o'clock, climbing into the 60s, then 70s around lunchtime. It'll be a good afternoon to go out and get some food from the food truck. Uh, this is going down at St. Mark's United Methodist. This is in Hanover. It starts at 4. We're sunny and 75, so not a better forecast to be out and about. And if you're heading to Meriwether Post Pavilion, they've had a quick, they've had a lot of uh, lineups uh, lately here. Kings of Leon tomorrow night, 730, 70 degrees. Going to be a beautiful evening. Now, high pressure will be shifting towards the east as we head into Saturday, and that does mean a change in the flow. Instead of it being a northwesterly component, it's going to be a southerly component. And that southerly component is going to warm things up a little bit. Initially, only a few degrees. We'll get into the upper 70s through the afternoon, cresting into the low 80s, keeping it sunny and dry throughout the entirety of your Saturday. But by Sunday, that northerly flow increases, and that's going to send those afternoon highs into the upper 80s. Some locations are actually going to flirt with 90. We're still going to keep sunny skies in the forecast, and that's going to be the dominant feature here. Up to 90 degrees by Monday, that's going to be the warmest day in the seven-day forecast. We're going to stay above average as we head into the middle of next week. 88 degrees into your Wednesday, slightly cooler down to the mid-80s by Thursday. Keeping an eye on the tropics, not a whole lot to talk about here. Hurricane Larry continues to churn to the north at 25 miles per hour. It's going to continue that forward speed in eventually lift off uh, towards the east of Nova Scotia and then eventually interact with Greenland as a tropical storm. The good news here, Mindy has been downgraded and is no longer a tropical system.